The dashboard home screen provides information about the site and about the WordPress community. When you first log in, you'll see the dashboard with the boxes in full open mode. Each box has a bar across the top that when clicked will collapse or expand that box. And by hovering the mouse over the bar and holding the left mouse button down, you can rearrange the boxes. Some of the boxes can be configured by clicking the configure link to expand the box for editing. You can also hide any of these boxes by clicking the screen options tab at the top of the screen and checking any box you want to show or unchecking any box you want to hide, including the WordPress welcome page. There's also an option for a multi-column layout. Just select the number of columns and any changes will automatically be saved and used the next time you log in. The Right Now box is a summary of what's happening on the site with a summary of the activity for the site. These are links to the various tables for editing. It also gives information about the active theme, the number of widgets, and the version of WordPress being used. And if you have privacy settings to block search engines, a reminder message appears in this box. Recent Comments displays up to 30 of the most recent comments with the beginning of the comment. Click on Configure to change the number of comments in this box. You can manage these comments by mousing over the comment and clicking an option on the edit line. You can approve a comment, unapprove a comment that's been approved, reply to the comment, edit the comment, mark it as spam, or send it to the trash. The line at the bottom of this box gives a summary of all the comments. Clicking on any of these links takes you to the table with a list of those comments. All comments, pending comments, approved comments, spam comments, and comments in the trash. Incoming links list all the outside links to the site. This is done automatically from the Google blog search. When a link is found, it's listed in this box. This box has a configure option for additional editing to change the RSS feeds, limit the number of items to display, and to display the item date. Click the Submit button to save any changes. The plugin box has information on three plugin feeds, most popular, newest, and recently updated from the official WordPress plugin repository. Plugins listed in this box can be installed by clicking on the Install link, or to get more information about the plugin, click on the Plugin Name link. QuickPress is handy for a quick post to the site. You can write, save, add tags, and publish or save a draft right from the dashboard. The Reset button clears the QuickPress screen. Recent Drafts list up to five drafts you have in process. A draft is a post before it's published on the site. The View All button at the bottom takes you to the Edit Post screen with a table of all the posts in draft mode. WordPress Blog pulls information from various sites about WordPress development. Clicking on any of these article titles will take you to that article. These feeds can be edited and configured. Other WordPress News pulls articles from WordPress Planet, which is a collection of feeds from the WordPress community that discusses WordPress around the world. Clicking on any of these links takes you to the article. This box also has a configure option so you can edit and configure the feeds. Remember you can hide and rearrange any of these boxes to fit your needs.